Rachel Lounder felt something was off. She was young, recently out of college, and now married with a young daughter, when she noticed some unaccounted for swelling near her neck and shoulder. I found a lymph node above my collarbone. At that point, we were hoping to expand our family, so I was really wanting to figure out what this lymph node was. I saw my PCP and he was concerned about the location, so I had a biopsy done, an excisional biopsy, and it came back falsely benign. And then I noticed that there was still swelling where that lymph node had been, so I went back to my PCP and was just like, this doesn't feel normal. And he was like, yeah, I don't think it is normal. Um, so I had a CT scan, which showed like a chain of lymph nodes going into my chest, which led to another excisional biopsy, which showed Hodgkin's. Although both Rachel and her husband, Cody, had suspected something was wrong, they were both shocked at this news. We were terrified and devastated, and I was mostly worried about how it would affect my daughter, Nora. Um, she was still really little at the time. When she got the diagnosis of Hodgkin's lymphoma, uh, it was very scary, and I was trying to be the strong confidant and just reassure her that, you know, we had figured it out and it'd be okay. The whole reason I ended up at New England Cancer Specialists is because my PCP had seen better outcomes from patients that they sent to New England Cancer Specialists versus other oncology practices in the area. They have a really unique way of prioritizing both the physical well-being of patients and the mental well-being. Everybody was just so comforting. Like, I felt like I got to know the receptionist. I got to know the ladies who drew my labs. Dr. Evans was always warm and reassuring and took the time to talk to me about my anxiety. New England Cancer Specialist knows that patients and their families need support not only during cancer treatment, but after treatment as well. That's why they've started a survivorship program to help former patients adjust to life after cancer. I think that New England Cancer Specialists starting a survivorship program is so needed and will make such a huge difference. There's this whole period of when patients are trying to reintegrate into normal life and there are physical side effects that you're still navigating. There's the mental trauma of having just gone through this very uncertain time and support during that time is so needed and crucial to get through it and start to feel like you can find your peace of mind again. They just have a phenomenal support system in place there. They have resources for you, as well as the staff is just unbelievable. Uh, they all were super kind, super helpful with any questions that we had. Rachel has seen a dramatic change in her outlook now that she's been in remission since 2017. Early on, she was fearful of looking too far ahead. I didn't want to get attached to the future. I didn't let myself look forward to things or fully feel like joy or excitement about things because there was this part of me that was like, well, you might not be here to experience them, so don't get too attached to that. Um, and as time has gone on, I've. I've let myself get attached to being around for the future and looking forward to things and experiencing joy. One of those joys is that Rachel and Cody were able to have another baby, and they are now a family of four. They say that life is good and back to a normal routine. We just want to have a, a, you know, a great childhood for our, our children, and we, we just want to spend as much time together uh, with them. I believe that New England Cancer Specialist is a place where you will get your best outcome, the best outcome possible, and they really care about making sure that it's not just like getting you in remission or getting your cancer treated. They care about you. If you or a loved one has received a cancer diagnosis and you would like a second opinion, give us a call. Our cancer experts are here to listen and here to help.